Hey Bikes, happy Tuesday. I'm Cody. Today we have more information on the bake sale and the upcoming spring musical. And I'm Zara, and your daily news starts now. The International Thespian Society will be having a bake sale tomorrow during seminar. We go to Miss Murphy to find out more. So we are getting ready to do the musical Little Shop of Horrors um, next week. And it's kind of a dark comedy uh, with music from the 60s uh, involving a killer alien plant that eats people. And uh, it's going to be really fun, so everybody should come see it. Uh, and you're having a bake sale to support DM show. So, uh, can you give us some more information about that? Yeah, sure. So we are doing a fundraiser to send our seven national qualifiers to nationals. So we are putting on a little shop of horrors themed bake sale on Wednesday during seminar. We'll have a little cart. We'll push it around to everybody's seminar. It will have cupcakes and gravestone brownies and monster cookies and other baked goods that are themed for our show. We'll also have punch and potentially some mint ice cream. So bring money. All the money goes to sending our seven kids to nationals, and it's going to be yummy. Is there anything else you would like to add? Come see the show. Don't forget to support the Thespian Society tomorrow during seminar. For only $1 at lunch, you can send a message to your friend in the cast or on the crew of the musical International Thespian Society. We'll deliver them right before the curtain opens each night. For $5, you can send one to the entire cast and crew that will read Yours out loud before the show starts you tonight. See Ms. Murphy and W7 for questions. Internship applications are due this Wednesday, February 28th on Schoology. Please, ex please go to the Class of 2019 Schoology page to access the application. Thanks for all seminars for participating in the Leadership Class Coin Drive. We raised $177.23. Ms. Martinez's class raised the most with $40.60. They will receive an ice cream party Wednesday, the 28th. Saturday, March 10th is this year's Scholastic Art Show. Any student can stop by and get a permission slip from Mr. LaDuke in room 901. Please do so by this Thursday, March 1st. Participating students will leave at 10 a.m. and be back by 7 p.m. Sophomores, the Seaman High School Bank is taking applications for the 2018 to 2019 and 2019 to 2020 school years. Students will learn the total operation of the bank as well as the banking industry. Applications are in the bank. Interviews will be during the week of March 5th through 9th. If you are interested in being room attendants and to help set up the rooms prior to the Pot of Gold FCC LA needs your support and help on March 7, 2018. Volunteering for donating supplies and food, visit Whitley in room E15 to learn more about what they need. Congratulations to Kylie Hawes for being Kansas State first vice president. Kylie will be installed at the FCC LA state meeting in April in Wichita. North Snook, our school store, will be open for all lunches on March 9th. If you're interested in buying any Viking apparel, please bring your money on March 9th to buy hoodies, jackets, shirts, and other miscellaneous items. Any student interested in teaching as a career can apply to the Kansas State Future Teacher Academy. You can pick up a form in Marshbank's room 920. The applications are due April 20th, 2018 to Miss Marshbank. Now after the break, we'll go to Cody for sports. Hey man. Hey man. Did you see that game last night? Yeah, I did. Man, that the quarterback just it all up. Yeah, he did. And then the receiver with that catch. Yeah. And then the game was just so completely a Yeah, it definitely was. Alright, see you man. See you dude. Stop. There's a better way. Hey man. Hey. Hey, did you see that game last night? Yeah, I did. 
Yeah, that quarterback just messed the play the whole game up. Yeah, he did. And then the receiver just balled that pass. Yeah. And the game was just awful. Yeah, it really was. All right, we'll, we'll see, see you, man. See ya. Are you tired of always dropping your phone? Well, now you can get a pop socket from the orchestra. You can easily watch videos, talk on the phone, and even use it as a fidget toy in class. It's very durable and even comes with the sturdy car attachment. Get yours at the North Snug during the home games at SHS. Pink out is the theme for tonight's sub-state basketball game at 7 p.m. No passes will be accepted. Administration is $6 for, for adults and $5 for students. Congratulations to both the boys and girls bowling teams. Last Friday, both teams competed at West Ridge Lanes and Regionals and qualified for state. The boys team won the 13-team regional in a tight match, edging out Topeka West and Shawnee Heights. Noah Belt shot 692 to claim top individual honors. Dylan Birkenbaugh and Clayton Mumford also received medals. The girls team took second place with Brianna Evans and Brooke Prescott receiving individual medals. Both teams will be competing for state titles this Friday at North Rock Lanes in Wichita. Good luck, Vikes. If you are interested in participating in the five-on-five -five soccer with Vikings United Unified Sports, please talk to Mr. Cromie. Practice begins next Tuesday, March 6th. The SHS baseball team will be hosting a dodgeball tourney on Saturday, March 10th at Seaman Middle School. Entry fee is $36 per team and six players per team. The three H divisions is elementary, middle school, and high school levels. Now over to Zara with the weather. Hey Vikes, let's dive deep into our daily weather forecast. Right now it's 58 degrees and tonight it'll be 47. This week we have highs in the 50s and lows in the 30s. It's K-pop singer Ten's birthday as well as National, I National Pancake Day. Make sure to get your free IHOP pancake. Now let's go back to your anchors. Remember to wear pink tonight and that's all we have for you today, Vikes. See you all next time.